nice to meet different people and have different conversations. Everyone's been very chatty, uh, so it's nice to get to know the communities at the library visits. Um, we, we meet a lot of people that wouldn't otherwise see anybody for the rest of the week, so it's, you know, yes, we definitely do see some very isolated people, yes. These days, because we are surrendering too much to robots and to have the warm company of people who actually breathe is wonderful. Having the opportunity of it coming out to those of us that don't have a chance to get into the town, absolutely brilliant. This is one of the most valuable uh, assets our community gets. Music is my hobby, and uh, it's anything that introduces people to music at any level, or, no, it's great. And a tap, tap, tap. <laughs> People just used to the library bus turning up, then to have live music and the chance to participate is just incredible, uh, especially in rural counties and, and Wiltshire itself. Uh, it's, it's not something that necessarily happens very often, so a great partnership and I hope it continues. My favourite moment of the day probably in, in lots of ways was the impromptu Morris dancing, hanky waving May Day parade where councillors were joining in with little kids and, you know, with, and some with disabilities and some you know, from older generation who never normally take part in that. And I, I love that whole that whole process is why we did it. And now that this link and partnership's been been formed, hopefully we can keep this going and make magical days throughout the year. And people make a lifestyle choice to 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 live here. Um, we want it to be a place that we can encourage our children and grandchildren to come back to and live because it's got that that community. And it's these sorts of events that make it vibrant. Um, so, you know, you will go to the city for some things, but it's great to, to have events that are going on in your community. Music helps us build bridges between people and culture. It's, there's no pain, you know, there's no anger even though some people might write angry music, but it might make people feel nice. <laughs> Music is about being involved, isn't it? And and it just means that everybody can take part in music. It's not just the musicians who may be professionally trained or not. I mean, everyone's got some musicality about them. Um, and it's, it's lovely to see that being drawn out, with, especially with the children that we saw earlier on as well. It's, it's mindfulness, isn't it? It's part of relaxing, it's understanding how music plays a part in keeping our spirits up. And, you know, music, music has a role. If you're sad, it makes you happy. If you're, if you're overexcitable, it can calm you down. And, and we use music in that way in school. I think actually calling a dance on the village green is possibly something that hasn't been done in this village for about 400 years. So it's, it's actually, that was a really nice moment. It's, it's a sunny day and it was quite nice to see sort of elder villagers and the next generation all dancing together on the village green. Let it rain all day, let it rain all day. And let the sun go behind the clouds, let all the cows sit down. Let it rain all day. It just gives joy. And particularly on a day like this, it's such a beautiful thing. And to come and we're, we're, we're a lovely, quiet place. And then to have music as well. It's, it's very, very special. Um, well, I think it's absolutely wonderful and we were taking the baby for a walk with the dogs so we came down to listen and it's been wonderful. <laughs> Oh
Going into the school today has been amazing, uh, just seeing all the smiling, happy faces whilst they're creating a piece of music is amazing, because uh, that's what we do with Rocks Puss, we go in and we write a new piece of music with the children, often about the school, and to see the children's ideas going into the song and to then see them singing about it is amazing. Seeing all the children and them really using this music to kind of get, um, find out a bit more for themselves about what music's all about and also the fact that the library's with it is really educational for them at the same time and it does encourage them to go and do more things musical, which is really great. Everyone deserves to be able to rock out, everyone deserves to be able to write music and everyone can write music and play music. So our mission is to get out there and bring music to as many people as possible. People have been really, really lovely. I mean, standing, playing our first venue in the rain, um, really quite heavy rain and people actually coming out in their umbrellas just to stand and, and listen was was quite incredible. <laughs> Good fun. Um, people have been so appreciative, it's been lovely. We've got quite an elderly um, community so they can't always get out um, so it's a great, great resource and it was uh, really entertaining. Music on the Move has been such a fantastic and inspirational project, working with so many professional and talented musicians that have taken live music and music making workshops into 27 rural villages across Wiltshire. We had kids as young as three up to somebody as old as 103 who were joining in. They were singing along, dancing along at Wiltshire Rural Music. We've seen how powerful music is in bringing the community together and we can't wait to take music on the move again in the future.